it might not look like it, but this is the top COVID testing spot in Dallas. The city's wastewater treatment plant off I-45 is testing some of the thousands of samples that pass through it. I think they've, they've got uh, good systems for that, uh, so it's pretty accurate, yeah. Dallas County Health Director Dr. Phil Wong says the CDC asked areas across the country to start sampling wastewater to track the spread of the virus. You're not identifying it in individual people, uh, but it does, you know, show if it's present in a big group of people. It's been going on for a couple weeks so far and involves people physically taking a sample of what passes through the facility on Mondays and Wednesdays. It's found about a 35 percent decrease compared to two weeks ago. At this point, it's still very early, but it's a little little hard to interpret still at this point. Okay. The COVID hospitalizations in North Texas have dropped 83 percent from the late January peak and testing is a fraction of what it was during that surge. Health officials believe the new system provides a better way to get to the bottom of what's happening in the whole area. A leading indicator for something like variants, um, and then a maybe trend indicator uh, to show if things are going up, things are going down. Houston is on year number two of using this system. It was ahead of testing and predicting the winter surge after noticing an increase in Omicron cases. It's another tool to try to get more information about what's going on in our community. It won't replace other measures, but could help the county get ready quicker if another surge arrives. In Dallas, I'm William Joel.